Hello guys, LJDC1998 here, and this is the Swap and Play Tour. We have a couple of points to make before we begin. One of them being, I'm sure you'll be disappointed, but there's no Swap and Play Tour footage. Please feel free to hit the dislike button if you like, but I assure you by the end of this video, it'll soon turn to a like. Now, I would like to explain why I have not been able to do footage. I've already explained this to ja to Match Attack Hero 26. And the reason for this is because the time I had with there was nothing. If you go to open something, or you go to film, someone will be at you immediately, wanting to trade or do anything. And there was so much going on, it was brilliant. There was no space to record at all. And by the end, when I was going to record, when everyone was gone, I simply couldn't because... That was awkward. Sorry about that. That was awkward. By the time I actually got down and started to do it, Nearly everything was gone, so there's just no point. But I got a lot done, and I've got a lot of stuff. And here's what it contains in the Swap and Play Tour episode that will definitely be more than one part. A new set. A collection completion. Doubled. Double collection. A new collection for the future. My binders. Complete. My sail binders, ready, and what is coming up in the future. First, I'd like to tell you that a lot has gone on in the Swap and Play Tour, a hell of a lot. One I've completed the collection, but another, the charity, the charity event, which was basically where you um, use your base cards, as I've explained in previous episodes. You use your base cards and buy goods, matched up goods, tops goods, other stuff like that. And also signed items. And I'm sure MD Sports, as soon as he's watched this, is going to say I told you so. But you weren't allowed to use all base. You only allowed to use 12, 13. In all the past years, you've been allowed. But this year, because of people like... I'm not going to say the name, but there's special people there who only come to get, say, Hernandez LA to sell them on eBay, who have thousands and thousands and thousands of cards, literally. And they buy the side it signed items so they can sell them on eBay. With the cards. And it just isn't fair on the other kids. I know I had 3,384... But that was from a very long... That was from me actually collecting them. Through trades. Ooh, just gave a bit away. But, anyway. So that is basically what happened. So you were only, you were only allowed 12, 13 trades. And you they decided this last minute. And you were only allowed to win one item. And you couldn't add any more base to it because you told them what you ha what base card you had. And then you had a ticket and they had it down how many you had. So you couldn't go over the limit and buy some more packs in time for you to do it, yeah. So yeah. But I'd just like to tell you guys that I did win something and it was good. It was a very good thing. And it is also the future of this channel. What I will be collecting. What I'm a big fan of in the future. I've already said that there will be a video soon saying what should I collect next. There's no need for that because I've already decided what I'm collecting next. And here it is. I won a tin, a multi-pack and a starter pack. I also got a box from the shop, a tin box for my set and a card box. Not full, but anyway. I also have two packs. This is the future. It's not football. 
Okay, guys. This is the future, guys. Of my channel. I'll be collecting alien attacks. Because I bid 580 cards and I won and I beat the Master of Match attacks in this bidding. I also beat him in the shuffle, just saying. And I won. An alien attack. Multi pack. An alien attacks. Starter pack. And if we go all the way over here. An alien attacks. Tin. So I thought if I'm going to win all that, I might as well collect it. Which is what leads me on. Which is what leads me on to my next point. This is what I'll be collecting from now on. Now I apologise if you were looking for football videos on this channel and you were hoping for Adrenaline XL update collection or Premier League stickers or something like that. And I'm sorry, but I wanted to stick with tops and attacks. And it was honestly either this or Championship or Scottish. But you couldn't get Championship or Scottish goods at the thing. And I thought, because I like Doctor Who and I'm a big fan of it, why not? I know you only get nine cards, but who cares? And I've practically got all the limited editions already. I think there only is four. And about what I'm going to show you next is four. Because I realise today is the third, and I don't collect the Doctor Who Adventures anymore. We're in the Doctor Who Adventures, I've already seen. I thought you could. Top Spinini tray to open it. And in Doctor Who Adventures, which I've already opened, but I'll still show you it was the Clara limited edition. So I think there only is four, and now I have all four. Obviously I won't have the complete set here, but I've got a pretty good job at it. And this is basically the future of me. So in this episode, in this part one, because it's only going to be 15 minutes long, I'm going to show you my set, and I'm going to open two packets, because I have two packets at the back, and that is what's going to contain. So here we go. This is my set. I'll just... Take away the tin and stuff. Up here we have the two tins. It's all dark over here, so I apologise. Ow. Over here we have my other tin and my future competition. My games guides. My mini binder. My big box for collector tins with two tins in it. There really is no light and I apologise. Then I have a box with two packets in it. A packet here. My championship heats card, regional heats, extra preview pack, an extra preview little card with two tops cards over here. Plus we've kept that. We have some German and Irish cards here. Plus the Squad binder thing, and this big sheet, which has all stayed the same, plus these sleeves. This will go, this is just where the cards I got in the other episode, because she wants to fill the space. So this is basically my set. Okay, now I've got a set tour, which was epic. Obviously in that tin spec, there will be not two tin. I'm so zoomed out because I actually want to get my whole set in now. I don't want to get some of my set in like I used to. I want to get the whole thing in. Obviously I can't get that big box in. Because I haven't got enough space. But oh well. So today. We've done the set tour. We're actually gonna, we've also got a mail day as well. And I've got to show you some stuff. I've got a swap play tour. But we're going to open two packets first. So this is where we zoom in. So I like what I can do here, I can just take the camera and zoom in. 